American oh. fiction. Yes. Oh. Absolutely awesome. Oh, thank you very much. Congratulations. It's lovely to have you here in London. Thank you. Is this a whirlwind award season? How does this feel for people that are watching? It feels a bit like you're uh, on a hamster wheel inside a circus train, just going from one stop to the next. But it's great for our film that uh, it's garnering this level of attention and recognition and appreciation from our peers. Uh, we make these movies, oddly enough, so that audiences will see them. So this helps get the story out and, uh, and I'm super grateful for, uh, for the position we found ourselves in. Any news? Editors, they want a black book. They have one. I'm black and it's my book. Look at what they expect us to write. Would you read an excerpt? Yo, Sharonda, where you be going in a hurry like that? If and you got to know, I was going to the pharmacy. Congratulations, Oscars, BAFTAs, Critics Circle this evening. You know, people often say, do awards matter? You just mentioned the audience is going to see this film. Do they matter? Does, is it nice to get acknowledged? Well, the, the BAFTAs this year don't matter for me, <laughs> particularly. Uh, I was not uh, deemed worthy, um, so that one doesn't matter. <laughs> How does that feel? Listen, Awards are great, uh, particularly as these are when voted for by our peers. That's really meaningful. Um, when I'm working on a film set, if uh, the idea of an award creeps into my head at all, I try to delete it. I have mantras that I use to get that away from me as quickly as possible because it distracts from the work. What is this? Deadbeat dads, rappers, crack, and black, right? Nobody's gonna publish this. Just wanna rub their noses in it. We love it. What? what? It is very, uh... Black? Yes, that's it. I'm happy you said it and not me. <laughs> We're a small film. Yeah. We shot this film in 26 days. The budget of our film is probably the catering budget for the last James Bond movie that I, <laughs> that I did. So this is really helpful for us. Um, it does become a little bit like the Hunger Games where we're now competing with other artists who have done this year beautiful work and it just, you know, it just seems a little bit odd. Um, but at the same time, uh, I'm grateful to be included. We sold the movie rights. Yes! We think it is going to be the bestseller. I'm sure white people on the Hamptons will delight in it. Yeah, we will. They, they, we, it's going to be huge. It's so smart, so so on the like. It's unapologetic, but also very timely. I, I appreciate that. I, we we agree with you. But if we don't have the backing from the studio, the invest from the powers that be, from those who finance these films, if we can get that, then our work gets out there. Um, there's a difference with this film as well in that Alana Mayo, who is the head of Orion Films, is a black woman who recognize that this is a, a story that could find an audience. It's a story that's timely, that wants to be told now, and she supported us. So uh, we do our work. It's getting people in, uh, in positions of power to greenlight films who have an appreciation for that work and are willing to put themselves behind it. Listen, good luck, enjoy the season, and congratulations. I adore the film. Thank you very much. Can you stick around and help with mother? I gotta get home. It's eight in the morning. I'm not flying the fucking plane, bro.